Yeah, I think we're ready. Uh, we're, we're glad to be back in the NC2A Regional Championships. We feel like we have a very good team and a very good opportunity to win here. It is another game, uh, but it's, you're going to have to win wherever you are to move through this tournament. And uh, everybody's focused on doing that. Uh, does it bring with it a special emotion? I think that belongs to the players. I, I think that they know uh, our job is to try to keep the balance uh, and keep them focused on the fundamentals of the game and the process that they use to be successful rather than work on their emotions. You know, we just got to, you know, go and play like it's another game, you know, like it's a Big 12 conference actually. And, you know, we just got to play our game and come out and just be ready to play. A lot of guys came out and worked hard today, you know, hit the ball good and took, you know, took great defense and everything, and I think we're ready to play. Well, I know it's going to be half orange and half red in the stands, you know, and we just got to concentrate on that half, you know, and concentrate in our dugout and on our field and just compete, compete against the baseball, you know, and not against the other team in the uniform. I know a lot of these guys have played in, uh, you know, tournament styles in their high school. I know uh, personally playing uh, for Team USA, uh, that was a big time in the tournament environment, so I'm going to take from that a little bit. Um, but I think just treating it as any other baseball, college baseball game that we've played for the past few years and just keep everything normal, keep our routines normal and just take it as that and um, just be ready to play good baseball. We don't really look at roles on this pitching staff. We're just trying to get through 27 outs a game, um, one inning at a time, and everyone's on call at all times. And I think we know that as a staff, and I think we're prepared for that and we're ready to uh, take on that challenge. Yeah, I don't think there can be any predictions beyond just what goes on in the games and the unexpected is going to decide it. So uh, it's it's going to be an exciting tournament where anyone can win the tournament and then when you move from here you move uh, possibly to LSU and then you're going to have to win again and it just keeps going until you, you finally find a national champion out of the 302 schools that start. Uh, one will have a great year. We have a chance to be that one, and so does everyone else in the field.